Hello today and welcome back to P3P. More hanging out with Igus. The the final days were down to ten. Well eleven technically, but whatever. Muley! Right, Muley, I forgot. Is that a cat's voice? Could it be? There is a spotted white cat in the corner of the back alley. Are you Muley san? Meow! Holy shit, that's a big cat. Look at Mr. Tittles there. So you are Muley san. I'm so glad. Hamako san, let's go tell the old lady about this. That cat obviously did not have portrait art in the original game. Aw, oh, there, there. You seem a little skinnier than you used to be. You used to be even bigger? This little one is all I have left to keep me company. I was so lonely when Muley was missing. I don't know how I could thank the both of you. Lonely. Is being by oneself lonely? Oh yes, dear. When you get to be my age, you find that all the wealth in the world won't take care of you. Living alone is a dreadful thing. Some of my neighbors have delightful children, but they aren't interested in old ladies like me. Miss. Well, Muley, do you miss your basket and Blinky? Want to go home now? Thank you so much, you two. The old lady left. It seems that living is something that can't be done alone. Uh, you may be right. Yes. It's important to keep someone in your thoughts and to know that you are in theirs. To be able to contact them anytime and to touch them. But I do understand one thing. I feel happy when I'm together with you, Hamako-san. I guess smile shyly. However, I am so curious. If to live means to be able to connect with other people, how close to that goal can I come with a body like mine? Just kidding. I have been exceedingly timid lately. Is there something wrong with me, I wonder? We should start heading back. Well, now that we've maxed out Ken, there is nothing to do at nighttime, except occasionally walk uh, Koromaru and check the TV. During a live demonstration, a man wearing a bandana jumped up and spoke to the crowd. Nick Sama's descent is real, said the man after this. Go to my room and take a nice big nap. Take a big cat nap. Thursday, and no one came to talk to me. That's not a good sign. That's a bad sign. Oh my god, is there gonna be no one? There's, let me check again. There's no Yukari in there, right? I'm not blind. Uh oh. Faculty office hallway? Mitsuru? Phew, Mitsuru, thank god. I hope you rank up. But you might not, given that you didn't come talk to me at lunch. Gekogan High School Library. You accompanied Mitsuru to the library to help with some research. Uh. Looking for something? No, I'm not. Thank you, though. Looking through the literature section made me realize something. There are a lot fewer books about marriage and family life than there are romance novels. Do you think that means the most exciting time in one's life is before marriage? Is marriage worth that sacrifice? Well, to be frank, the group is in turmoil over the inheritance issue. To be honest, I'm having difficulty understanding the expectations of the other members. But I'm the daughter of the head of the group. I'm expected to lead the company, even if that requires me to sacrifice something to do it. A fiancé has been chosen for me. Time to get into this big old Japanese trope. He's the new president of one of our affiliates, and he's much older than me. But if I agree to the marriage, the future of the company will be secured. He's planning to announce the partnership and our engagement at the same time. Doing so will give the appearance that the company is stabilizing. It's the best solution for everyone involved. Uh, you're kidding, right? It is all true. It's all real. It has been decided for a long time, but it's going to take place sooner than originally planned. Personally, I'm fine with it. Contrary to her words, Mitsuru looks glum. My parents chose the same path, so I won't run from my destiny. Uh, you should reconsider. If I reconsider and decline the engagement, then what will I do? 
leave everything behind and go on a journey of self-discovery? Wherever I run, the road will lead to regret. This is such a big trope that they did it again in Persona 5. Like, chill out, Japan. Why was I born a woman? I have put forth many times more effort than others so that no one could look down on me because of my sex. And yet, what has that brought me? In the end, I cannot escape from the fact that I am a woman. Marriage to a near-complete stranger, having my name and group stripped from me, expected to conceive an heir, through marriage, the Carrillo group will prosper, because I am a woman. Where and there, however, am I needed? I apologize. It's not something I should be burdening you with. You two work hard as our leader. I was the one who chose you. Perhaps I forced the position on you, so that you could prove to me that there is no difference between men and women. Excuse me, but I'm leaving now. Aw, oh, coming back, Mr. Rule. Yeah, her, uh, her wink takes, like, a different context, huh? Today's Cantonese word is Holin. Holin means pitiful. Are we Holin to be living in this kind of world? Well, that's all for this week. Back to the news. Uh, you wanna go somewhere with me? Let's go, Koromaru. Let's go pick up some items. Hey, another homunculus been using them lately. There are a lot of enemies of Tartars that uh, use insta-kills. You overhear a conversation. Our career counseling is next week, right? Are you planning to go to a university, Yumi? Yep, I'm going to school overseas. Overseas? This is the first I've heard about this. I'm your boyfriend. You have to tell me this stuff. At least that one wasn't about apathy syndrome. Who we got? I guess, of course. And that's it. Great. Sorry, Miss Miyahara. I'm dozing off. Oh, there's Yukari. I bet Yukari doesn't want to rank up. I bet you anything. Let's check. Yeah, I knew it. Given that she got no points in that last event. Damn you, Yukari. They're still baby. Like, Bebe's never gonna max out. I have totally forsaken Bebe. That poor dude's gonna go back to uh, France. He's gonna have no friends. All right, I guess. Let's rank up. Oh, that old lady. She is Mui san's owner. You follow Igus' line of sight. That certainly is Muli's owner. She is with a male Gekukon high student. Yo, Granny, I got to date tomorrow. Yeah, this guy didn't have portrait art before. But, uh, I don't have any money or anything, you know? Oh my, is that so? You poor dear. You're such a good boy, Kiyoshi. This advance on your allowance will just be between you and me. Come on, quit it. I told you not to call me Kiyoshi. But it's such a beautiful name. I picked it out, you know. It was the name of a fine doctor from my home village. Yeah, I know. That's only the 80 millionth time you told me. Come on, hook me up already. Oh, yes, yes. This isn't much. Try not to spend it all in one place. Yeah, yeah. See ya. Be careful, dear. And visit again soon. After taking the money, the male student trotted away. And almost crashed the game. This Kiyoshi-san, I wish to speak with him further. I guess she's after Kiyoshi. Kiyoshi-san, please wait. Jeez, don't freaking call me that. Huh? I guess, senpai. Do you know me? Well, doi, you're famous. I'm Kiyoshi Sakuma, a frosh. Frosh. Ugh, you're first here. Shut up. Everyone calls me Joe, so if you could just... I would like to ask you something, Kiyoshi-san. Is that alright? Uh, sure. Kiyoshi-san, do you feel lonely when you are by yourself? Huh? What? Your grandmother said that she is lonely because she has nobody else. What? Is this a lecture? No, I simply wish to know. 
Why don't you visit your grandmother more often? Her loneliness. If you are her relative, you may have the power to alleviate it. Nah, I'm just her grandson. But I know a lecture when I hear it. Say out of stuff that doesn't concern you, okay? Hiyoshi-san, have you ever considered what it means to live? To live? Personally, I think the bonds between people are what's most important. That is what your grandmother is slowly losing. To live? Are you kidding? No one seriously talks like that. What more do you need out of life than to have a blast? Having a blast? I mean, you're happy when you're having fun, right? So hell yeah, we're alive to be happy. To be happy? So what do you say, Aegis Senpai? Hamako Senpai too? If you got time, why don't we... Thank you, Kiyoshi-san. Let's go, Hamako-san. Huh? Wait, 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 wait. That's it? You really came and talked to me just to ask me that? What is this, some kind of cult? Scary, man. I can't understand Kiyoshi-san's feelings. Did I do something wrong? Uh, he wanted to date you, you brushed him off. You didn't call him Joe. No, you didn't. Uh, let's go with the first one, it's the truth. A date. That is an activity commonly performed when two people like each other, correct? Does that mean that you and I are currently on a date? Perhaps that was not quite properly phrased. Aw, she's embarrassed. Ever since I decided to live, I've been using words like why and how more frequently. The more time I spend with you, the more things I discover that I cannot understand. But the reason why I'm not alive, it remains a stumbling block. Is this frustration? But at the same time, I feel fortunate. Although I'm not human, I enjoy a few privileges others do not. After all, I am able to be near you, the one most precious to me. It's strange how two conflicting feelings can coexist. You can sense Igus's feelings. To be honest, my feelings toward Kiyoshi-san are unusually harsh. Kiyoshi-san has warm, soft hands he can use to feel those precious to him. And yet he... What is this ugly feeling? I wonder, is this jealousy? Let's stop this. It isn't right. Yes, I'll stop right here. Shall we go home then? Shihuman Entrance exams are looming for the city's student population. However, with the occultists around, please be careful. Oh, he's fine. He don't want to go for walk. I want to go for sleep, though. Me big sleep. Oh, well, there's Aegis still. What about Mitsuru? She's here. Let me save state it. Is this a rank up? Or do you need points? I'm hoping either her or Yukari will come talk to me tomorrow. Okay, this is totally a rank up. I thought that was maybe a Passover event. Uh, so let's do the math, because we're clearly not going to max everyone out. I mean, <laughs> obvious at this point. <laughs> So we have, what, eight days. One of those will go, the final one probably, will go to Akinari. I believe he's available still on the 31st. Um, I have four ranks to go with Mitsuru, three with Yukari, and two with Pepe. Kid fuck Pepe, <laughs> that's never happening. Uh, the, the judgment rank up happens when you climb Tartarus, so. Like, I'm going to hit probably like rank 9 when I grind off camera. I can't remember if rank 10 happens when you get to like the very end of the game or... I don't know. And 4 with Aegis. Ah, this is hard. Yeah, there's not enough time to do all three girls. We can get two maybe. <sighs> okay. Let's go with Mitsuru. I feel like Mitsuru has less days. Well. Yes, let's do it. Uh, I feel disappointed. 
Like, I didn't come nearly as close as I wanted to. I think I've acquired a taste for fast food. The world is much bigger than I thought. Rather, my world was much too small. From my point of view, your world is so brilliant. When I'm with you, I discover so many new things about myself. Laughter, anxiety. It's quite an education. If only it could go on forever. It sure sounded somewhat sad. Yuki. When you're with me, what do you think? Uh, I enjoy myself. I see. I'm glad to hear that. These days spent with you will no doubt be treasured. I'll keep them near to my heart. Feel a sense of affection for Mitsuru. Well, that was not a whole lot. <laughs> that was very Where simple. Been? been eating some wok. Every channel is showing news related to the cult. All right, Koromari, you want to go for a little walk? Want to go pick me up an item? Bomb of life. Not bad. There goes my great condition, though. All right, this time we save state. Yukari? Mitsuru. Uh... I'm going to decline this and see if someone else calls. And we'll cheese it. Wow! Yukari not calling. Well, screw you too, Yukari! Alright, Mr. Yu, let's go on a date. You would hold I strip mall, book on. You're having a good time hanging out with Mitsuru. I didn't realize how many different types of manga there are. Mitsuru seems to be a little daunted. I have a question. Why do people go to manga cafes? You can't borrow any of the books like at a library. And you have to pay admission to get in. Since manga aren't that expensive, why don't people just buy them? Uh... It's a nice environment. I see. Well, they do let you eat in here. And it's open late. Today you learned something new about her. You recall that you have a present. Uh... Don't. I don't know what she'd like. Greetings. No, not you, Koromaru. TV. Turn on the TV. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger, Philip it all. Final episode, Fly Phoenix. A marriage between Hawk and Swan. And as for Condor. And now the news. Cult membership continues to grow. Wow. I think that is the final one. I don't think we're allowed to check the TV next Sunday. I think we're locked into the final battle by then. Well, we're in the final week. I did not mean to go outside. I'm dumb. Go to my room. Here we go. One last week. I've heard a lot of talk lately about salvation and the world becoming renewed. If the apathy syndrome is becoming widespread, maybe that's a good thing. Yeah, I'm always hearing it. People talk about it on TV. I thought it was a cult at first, but maybe it isn't. I mean, if the whole world believes it in it, I'd feel stupid to be the only one denying it. Doze off. Very much so, please. Oh, Gekogan High School's faculty office. This is about my future or something, right? You're here for your academic counseling with Miss Toriyumi. Let's begin, shall we? I don't have much to say, though. In the end, it's your decision. All right, first question. Are you planning on going to college after you graduate or entering the workforce? I plan to get a job. I see. Well, if you've given serious thought to your decision, then I believe that is what you should do. Now, it's important to keep in mind that this decision is yours and yours alone. If someone else makes it for you, you'll regret it later. And then you'll have to live with the consequences, whatever they may be. But to be honest, I'm quite confident in you. You've really matured over this last year. I'm sure you're aware of it as well. 
What do you think has helped to bring about this change the most? Uh, b -b 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 various encounters. I see. Well, whatever the reason, you should be proud of the young woman you've become. That's all for now. I hope you have a successful senior year. Let's see. Uh, who's next? Ah, uh, I guess son. Would you mind letting her know? Thank you. I am proud of the young woman I've become. What's up, I guess? Uh, I was looking for you. Hmm? I'm sorry I went off on my own. I guess seems to be lost of thought. When I finally calmed down after New Year's, I realized something. When I fought Ryoji, I got really scared when my consciousness began to fade. But that wasn't all. I was also confused and embarrassed when I realized I couldn't defeat him. But I couldn't defeat him ten years ago either, and I didn't have those feelings then. I... I really have changed. I've been thinking a lot about this change that's occurred in me. You know, in the past if I didn't understand something I would just ask someone to explain it to me. But since I've decided to live, no one's been able to answer the questions I've been facing. However, there is one thing I've come to understand. The reason why I wanted to be close to you was so I could monitor death, but... Even though death is gone now, I... I still want to be by your side. I still don't know what it means to live yet, but I want to learn the answer, and I think I can, if I'm with you. So please, please take me with you. I may not be strong enough, but I'll fight with you to the end, please. Thank you. You suddenly remembered that Miss Toriyumi is waiting to meet with Igus. You leave the rooftop with Igus. Okay, she's getting counseling. That leaves us to do something else, which is maybe nothing. That would be embarrassing, wouldn't it? Oh, this is embarrassing. Ah, uh, you know what I should have done? Should have not have hung out with Akihiko a week ago. Because then I could have done that now. Whoops. Oh. Wait, let me test this. Well, nope. Oh, well. I thought... So there's a little problem here. I thought Akihiko and I were like a thing. But apparently we're not, and I don't know why. It's really confusing. Did I not, like, raise enough romance flags with it? But we... Didn't we become a couple? It's really confusing. Let's go to the shrine. Uh... Sure. Friends? God, this really doesn't matter at this point. But we're not gonna be able to finish Ikari. I might as well just pull it for, uh... Bitsuru. I don't know if she needs this, given that we just did a date with her yesterday, but it doesn't hurt to try. Man, did you see that? I lost money and I became Hi. sick. Or tired or something. What was that? That's bullshit. That's not fair. Every channel is showing news related to the cult. I'm going to bed. I'm not going to let this tiredness become a cold. Whoops. I will recover from this. You don't seem to be feeling well. Go to bed early. Please let my condition improve. Thank goodness. What's up, Mitsuru? And I guess... Oh boy, this is this is pick and choose time. Screw you, Yukari. It's gonna be I guess. Ah, 
I hope I didn't screw up and like not leave enough time, but I'd like to at least finish, I guess. Ah, you're Kiyoshi-san's grandmother, correct? Greetings. Oh, you're those nice students from before. Hello. You have great timing. I was just thinking about seeing you two again. If you want the truth, Muli has disappeared again. Again? Well, don't worry. At least this time, we have an idea of where she may have gone. No, that's alright. I believe that this time, Yuli went in search of something. In search of something? Yes, for a place to die. When cats perceive that their life is nearly over, they leave on their own to wait for the end. Yuli even came to say goodbye to me before she left. And so, I don't think I'll need you to find her anymore. I just wanted to thank you for letting us see each other one last time before the end. Muli san died? Well, good day now. Um, you're um, you're not alone. I'm certain of it. Well, of course I'm not alone. As long as there are people left in the world, no one can truly be alone. I'm fine as long as there are people like you around. Miz. Bless you, dear girl, for your kindness to an old lady. Toodaloo. Yoshi-san said that people live to be happy. Was Muli-san happy? Uh, I'm sure of it. Was Muli-san grateful to have been born? I'm sure she was. For what purpose was Muli-san born? Uh, no one can say. Life. Where does it originate? Where does it go? What reason does life have to exist? To live is to be connected to people, but life eventually ends. Parting seems to be a natural and inevitable aspect of life. An unavoidable end. Life is cruel. I wonder, will the day come when I must part with you forever too? I do want to live, but that's not all. That is to say, I don't want to merely become close to a human. I want to... With you... What... What is this feeling? What do I want to do? She confused. I don't think I'm going to max this out. I might have screwed up. Bye, I guess. Farm found five eggs already with no yolks. What the? According to the village legend, eggs like these are signs of extreme misfortune. The villagers are becoming terrified that a catastrophe is about to happen. You don't say. Uh, my room. Go to bed early? I should be in great condition now. Oh, yay, I guess I'm staying out again. I was afraid she wouldn't want to rank up after that. Let's do it, I guess. Gekko Gun High School rooftop. The wind is calm today. I don't detect the unusual scent of the sea. I guess suddenly became quiet. I'm sorry about last time. Perhaps my heart is becoming more and more like that of a human. But as a result, I've realized something. The heart and body are inseparable. A human heart can only function normally within a human body. Um, have you ever come here alone with a male before, Hamako-san? Perhaps you gazed out at the view and spoke quietly. Oh, I didn't mean to pry. I was just curious. Uh, technically we did? With Agihiko, I think? Let's just say no, though. I see. Oh, is that because I take up so much of your time? Actually, I was becoming a little worried. I thought that perhaps I was spending too much time with you. There are many people who would like to be with you. I'm sure you have people you want to be with as well. If that is the case, please tell me right away. I wouldn't want to become an obstacle preventing you from becoming closer to another person. Hmm... I don't mind you being here. The view from this rooftop is wonderful. That must be why when I come here after school, Sometimes I find a couple alone here. They might be leaning against one another or embracing. I never gave it a second thought before, but lately, it pains me to see them. 
I have probably come to realize that this is a sort of connection I can never attain. I am not a male. I'm not even human. The closer my heart becomes to that of a human, the more I realize how much sets us apart. Just because my heart is developing doesn't mean I can actually become human. I have known this from the beginning, of course. But only recently have I realized something. I have another wish, one just as precious as my desire to live. My realization is that this second wish can never be granted. I'm sorry. I lost control of myself again. But this feeling that you are precious to me will never change. No matter what happens. Can I do it? Maybe? I don't think so. I think we're going to be like a day short. Until now, I have always referred to you as something precious to me. But that is not the correct way to express this feeling. However, if I were to use the proper words, I know it would never come true and I... She ran away. Where have you been? Four more days. Actually, Akihiko, I am up for that. Because I don't really have a choice at this point. No, 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 boy. Save your energy. We're going to Tartarus, actually. I want to check the TV, though. Woman scolded a group of teenagers for spraying graffiti. She was, su she was subsequently stabbed by one of the youth as the rest of them fled the scene. Doctors say the woman was lucky and that her wounds will take around one week to heal. Wow. Okay, let's save the game. So I gotta go to Tartarus and climb a whole bunch of floors and I'm gonna hate my life. And uh, I don't know if, like how long it'll take for the next video to come out because it might take a while. I might lose motivation halfway through it and then put it off by several days. I don't know. I also gotta remember to go check my equipment and whatnot and go talk to uh, Kurosawa and do all that other stuff. Oh man, we're almost at the end. We're very, very close. And uh, we'll see if I can finish at least one more link before we go take care of the whole Nyx problem on Sunday.